Istanbul, Turkey. In a move seen as a historic milestone in the country's ongoing defense transformation, Turkey is preparing to unveil its most advanced domestically developed ballistic missile, Tayfun, at the upcoming IDEF 2025 International Defense Industry Exhibition in Istanbul. More than just a new weapons project, the missile symbolizes Turkey's strategic ambition to become a self-sufficient regional power in long-range precision strike capabilities. Developed by the Rocketson, a state-owned defense company at the forefront of Turkey's strategic weapons innovation, Tayfun is billed as the longest-range missile the country has ever produced, with a stated range of 500 to 800 kilometers and a projected capability to exceed 1,000 kilometers in future iterations. In recent years, Turkey's Presidency of Defense Industries, SSB, has accelerated efforts to build a fully independent defense ecosystem aimed at reducing dependency on foreign technology. Rocketson, a core pillar of this effort, has led the Tayfun project with three core principles, precision, mobility, and survivability. Rocketsan officials have indicated that the missile is designed with high accuracy within five meters, making it capable of engaging both stationary and moving targets, including warships at sea. This places Tayfun firmly in the realm of strategic weaponry designed not just for defense, but also for power projection, an increasingly sought after capability amid regional tensions. One of Tayfun's key features is its mobile launch platform. Designed for rapid relocation and quick deployment, the system offers critical tactical advantages in high-intensity combat environments, where launcher survivability depends heavily on its ability to avoid early detection and destruction. Its shoot-and-scoot capability makes Tayfun very difficult to neutralize in high-threat environments, said a senior defense analyst in Istanbul. This adds significant deterrence value, especially when combined with precision strike capability. According to multiple defense observers following the project, Tayfun is categorized as a hypersonic missile, likely exceeding Mach 5. This makes it virtually impossible to intercept using conventional air defense systems. Furthermore, the missile is said to be jam-resistant, maintaining navigational accuracy even in complex electronic warfare scenarios. This is a crucial feature in today's battlefields, where electromagnetic warfare has emerged as a decisive dimension of modern conflict. By showcasing Tayfun at IDEF 2025, Turkey is signaling not only its technological achievements, but also its evolving strategic military doctrine, one that shifts from a purely defensive posture to a capacity for precision strikes beyond its borders. With a range that covers much of the Middle East, the Aegean, and Southeast Europe, Tayfun's strategic impact cannot be overlooked. Its emergence could alter regional power dynamics, especially amid tensions with Greece, Russian naval activity in the Black Sea, and NATO's shifting posture in the aftermath of the Ukraine war. While the current version of Typhon is reported to have a maximum range of 800 km, sources within Turkey's defense industry suggest that there are ambitions to push its range beyond 1,000 km. If realized, Turkey would technically enter the ranks of nations possessing medium-range ballistic missiles, which are MRBM, a group that currently include China, Iran, India, and Russia. Such a move may invite greater scrutiny from NATO and European partners, but for Ankara, it likely aligns with the broader doctrine of strategic autonomy, long championed by President Recep Tayyip Erdogan, as part of the country's grand vision for the century of Turkey. IDEF 2025, scheduled to be held in the second half of next year in Istanbul, has become Turkey's premier stage to showcase its defense innovations to the world. The presence of Tayfun as one of the event's highlights reflects how the country is prioritizing military industrialization, not only for domestic needs, but also for export potential. Turkey has emerged as one of the world's most aggressive defense exporters, with clients across Asia, Africa, and Eastern Europe. If Tayfun becomes export certified, it could open up markets traditionally dominated by powers like the US, Russia, and China. With Tayfun, Turkey reaffirms its march toward strategic defense independence. The missile is not merely a weapon, but a political statement, a symbol of industrial capability, and a tool of hard diplomacy. In a rapidly shifting global security architecture, systems like Tayfun will play a pivotal role, not only in strengthening national defense, 
but also in securing Turkey's place among the emerging global powers.